Blog Talk Radio. Hello, good day, people. Today is July 21st, Monday, July 21st. Sayubrius, Sayubrius, blessings. Um, Sayubrius, my name is Ivy Latla, Three Gal Street Me Company. Street Me is a community organization. And yes, we are trying to do the dang on thing. I went to a meeting today, and um, remember I had missing, missing something in terms of true amelioration, so we're kind of on the true amelioration side. Um, you know, I did mention that we have projects. Barge Road is, um, I am thinking about Barge Road. Um, I have done some cleanup here and there. Um, well, boy, I tell you the gun on this truth, I was more interested in trying to get back to um, the office so I can try to do some paperwork and do some small studies. I tell you the gun on this truth, you know, hey, this paperwork, you know, I have to write letters, I have to send out proposals, I have to check my emails, I have to do this. And so this is kind of like what it is. That's, um, you know, as I stated before, it's like right now you have to look for resources, okay? And so what happened is that I was looking at some um, government entities to try to, um, you know, see how I can do some subcontracting. We and I'm actually just going to wait a little bit on that because until this young lady comes back, that she can explain it to me. So I had went to the score thing today, and I ain't going to say it to you. I'm like, and you know, I, <laughs> I don't know it's not like that, but honey, I ain't going to fib you. <laughs> That's what I told the man. Honey, I ain't going to fib to you, honey. We sitting here, we, so we communicating, and yes, I want to find what you're saying is, is as if it's informative. But <laughs> uh, uh, my time is valuable, and I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I know I'm there trying to get some help from him, right? <laughs> I think I could probably have told him a little bit more <laughs> than all that stuff he was pushing out. <laughs> oh, that's all I really have to say. You know, finally, this is about it. This is like a look. <laughs> so how do I'm? Hey, I'm a Lori man. How do I associate with people who got some money? <laughs> Okay, <laughs> so yes, honey, I ain't going to fix you, honey, it's an upgrade, upgrade, because <laughs> I'm like, wow, you know, uh-huh, <laughs> moving right along from over there, so anyway, I went over, <laughs> sorry, this is just because it's funny, because you said that. he was like really trying to be directive in how I should write my notes. And um, you can write this down, right? And I'm like, I don't even misunderstood. I guess if you do something, and you know, from his perspective, we read off things from his perspective, what he thought was important <laughs> and was the start. Now, the the truth of the matter is, one of the main things that most people are going to say is, <laughs> this will be the first from most people who are going to consider. You know, we're thinking that, um, hey, there's some project out there, they'll be helpful, they'll be useful, and the answer to that is yes, there is, there are. Um, you just, because especially when you're dealing with certain areas, when you know and they know that they can promote jobs for other people or, you know, in your areas, then the answer to that is yes. But if it's just a small, mind you, yeah, a lot of people who go and apply for small businesses, and, you know, hey, they don't worry, have to worry about thinking about if they want to get involved with the government. You know, most people who want to do business or have a flow, they want to, have, you know, be able to manufacture products for, you know, various countries as well as, you know, our country too, okay? But if you're, hey, you know, and not to sit here and say cosmetologists are not needed, <laughs> okay? And, you know, or, you know, people who may manufacture liquor and, you know, and all those other kind of things because they buy those things too. You don't get it twisted. Damn bad. But, you know, we ain't gonna argue with you. <laughs> so anyway, he's like a, <clears throat> um, I mean, yeah, first thing first from this perspective is where is the money. Now, if you don't have no money, then you have to find folks with money. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, you have to be in that company. You got me? You understand what I mean? Okay. I'm oh like, for real, now that I look more and more into it, I'm like, honey, uh-uh. 
some of that stuff we go rap, 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 rap. We've been wasting. This has been looking like this. no, right, no. <laughs> uh, uh. Anyway, uh, what business? He said number one is what business am I in, or you know what is the business? Then the other one is is it a competitive market? Number three is what is unique? What is different? Number four is the background. Do you know the industry? Number five is what are the written plans? Do you have a business plan, an operating print plan, and uh, an operating plan and an operating budget? You know, I have ticket scratch. <laughs> so those are the Okay, um, and what is the source capital? Um, where to get the money? Okay, and then that was number six. And then number seven is who is the support group? So you would know that support group and where is the money number one? Okay, from any perspective, because I go through, I'm like, okay, hi, how you doing? Well, I'm like, okay, you know, sometimes, you know, like I had someone give me a call and I was, remember, I'm, I'm asking for board members, okay? You know, yeah, I could throw a couple of names on there, but it's just not right because you know why street me is like that. Anyway, <laughs> so anyway, I was like, um, well, I'm just telling you the truth. Um, so anyway, this guy, he was calling me and I was talking with him in regards to street me company. And I was just speaking to him, and it's just like, well, listen, you know, end time means that you may have a knowledge base about this, that, and the other, but it is true, you know, you have to think, consider, you know, check and balance. So I ain't going to say it to you, maybe I ain't going to, but then I'll just move on from there, you know, be like, hi, how you doing, you know, and I still have business cards, and yes, I will move my business cards, yes, yes, yes. <laughs> Street me company. You know why? Because I want people to actually participate and understand what we are what we are about when it comes down to true amelioration, Kai Society, Naguzo Saba, Tulips, and yes, the conversation of Street the Point. That's what we're on right now. Street me the point. Anyway, uh, <clears throat> when you're looking at so the question was is, you know, your support. Well, everybody got something going on. Well, you have something going on. Or, you know, the say, not everybody is leadership material. It is just the truth. Now, there is a difference between leadership and management. It is it's just, it's just the truth. It really is. And so when we look at um, not only your support, because if you have the support, you have people who are willing to work with you so that you can achieve goals. You can achieve those goals so that you can be effective, okay? So now when you look at, um, other areas, you know, there are people who want to provide information, so they want to all this in kind. So when I went to the SBA, SBA actually have people there to provide information and have conversation. Whereas when you go to some meetings, it's a little different, where they're actually on the teaching end, and the other one is more of an informative end. I think there's a difference, teaching and an informative, being informative and teaching. But okay, that's fine. Sydney Company, once we get to that area, will be, here it is, this is what we can do to make some money kind. <laughs> okay. <laughs> we need you to be on this. We need you to access this. We need you to attend these classes. Okay, we want you to establish these relationships here. These things allow us to try to create the But you can there was just like, uh-uh, I ain't going to fit these. I wasn't trying to be, you know, funny acting or nothing. No, I guess I was. <laughs> <laughs> and yes, he's a you know a veteran over there at school, but I'm like, don't get me misunderstood. I'm coming here <laughs> to receive a service from you, and I want you to talk to me about what, how I'm able to benefit from those services. Now, we just having a conversation. You ain't telling me how to write my business plan. You ain't giving me no sheet of paper. Like, I to, don't get me wrong. I have to come back, you know, come and talk to you and this, this, that, and the other, maybe. You know, hey, not saying that here it is, I'm not going to need your services for reason I count it. But come on now. So I guess I have to write my little business plan for you to look at. <laughs> but I don't know what I want to do. That's why I come to school. You know what I mean? You don't know exactly what you want to do, 
But you know, here it is. There's some entrepreneurial thoughts there. <sighs> Boy, I tell you, hey, business is work. And no, you do not need a degree for that. You just have to have some business sense. You know, so here it is back in the day. You know, they really did make a lot of entrepreneurs. You know, I don't give you this, but I ain't trying to support it. But, you know, all those people out there, I, I said I'm not trying to support that, okay? But I just want us to understand this something, okay? But, you know, we have some men out there selling dope. Now, you know, that's back in the day, right? Okay. Well, they were out there selling marijuana and all that kind of stuff. You know, that was a, that's a business. Think about it. Here it is. Not only did they have to walk up and down the street, if it was got to that point, but they stood out on the corners. People either came to them, they started putting the suckers in the bag. What's the word? I ain't talking about them. Now, here it is. They put their stuff in the They had to weigh out the product. They had to do this. And, man, here, they had to keep posts. They were out there. They have men right now. Entrepreneurs walking up and down the street selling to me. Probably some of the best sales people. Hey, how you doing? Because when you're thinking about selling, you do not look at any of those barriers <clears throat> that some people may have when it comes down to communication. Okay, so they're going up and down the street asking somebody, "Hey, can I get <clears throat> you want a CD? Two for five dollars. Two for five dollars." <laughs> Hey, how you doing? You know, people looking for that quality stuff. Oh, hey, how you doing? This is, so at that point, it becomes something different. You feel me? Okay. It becomes work. I mean, people get up, they do, whether they're doing their, they're selling their T-shirts and this, this, that, you know, big ups. We all entrepreneurs, okay? I'm just the truth. We have people selling their clothing. For some reason, maybe we don't see in this. That's why I have to ask a few people when I was looking at I said, what is it that you see that's different? People are actually doing things. Oh, here you see. I was like, well, what is it that you, you know, are you missing? Are you comparing, you know, this area because it doesn't look like, you know, Linux Mall or something? But we got it going on, people. Except that, let the EX fit the AC. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Anyways. Wow. Wee. Okay, she me mingle. Uh-uh, I ain't going to talk about that. She needs a point. We are on air 30 minutes daily, starting at 11.30 p.m. Listeners, in the future or today, you can call 646-564-9776. Listeners, you can call six. I say I'm not supporting here. It is the folks selling drugs up and down the street. I understand over a period of five, ten years uh, in the 70s, 80s, you know, here it is, those young men, they could have been going to college and getting a college education. This is where we need them now. Hmm. But yet when you think about it, a lot of them people, boy, I tell you, they, you know, hey, they were making money. Yes, I'm not sitting there supporting Now We have a lot of fallen soldiers on the ground from, from BS, see? But you know what I mean. I wish they would have put more interest just like that on them houses that we got emptying off them homeless and things up there, homeless on the street, smoking dope. Can you learn that? <laughs> you see what I'm saying? You can talk about upgrading. Yes, instead of those men sitting out there thinking that they, what? You have no daddies in the homeless shelter on drugs, okay, and geeked out on alcohol. You want to talk about me. Please, go get your daddy out of the shelter. A lot of them men are sitting in there waiting on their sons to come and help them. If you feel like you want to work anything, please, we have real estate. Oh, that don't went somewhere else. Okay. Anyways, uh, Chevy Mingle will be Sunday, August 3rd, 2014 at 2 p.m. Hope to see you there at the Southwest Library. Okay, and um, tour is July 25th, 2014, 3 p.m. at the Stone Mountain Park. It is a two-day event, and you must make reservations. Um, there's a lot of, please support your neighborhood association, okay? Um, there's, I mean, they, a lot of these clubs have different things going on. Unfortunately, I had missed the King's area uh, meeting. 
um, I was really looking at their sign too, so I was like, oh, okay, I'm thinking it was Friday, but it's really a Thursday. That meeting, I think it's two in a row already. Um, I have not, uh, I have not really, well, first of all, for the auditorium, I have not talked about the auditorium because um, I'm waiting on some paperwork. Um, in terms of the the speed bumps and stuff over there on Barge Road, I do need to go to the Barge Apartments and actually um, follow that conversation with um, the representative there. I do want to speak with some of the neighbors in that particular area about the speed bumps. You know, that right there is really more on the weekend kind of conversation. It's blessing that has gone somewhere else. Wow. Um, that's more on the, you know, weekend. You know, people at home and all that kind of thing. So maybe I'll try to get that um, achieved this weekend. So in terms of those little small community things, yeah, that's fun. Yay! We do have the horseshoe. That is a project. I did not go and inquire with um, Foundation Center. I didn't do that yet. The reason why, as I'm going here and there, I'm talking to people here and there. You know, you want to get, you know, I guess some... Um, Hey, you know, okay, I will have some, oh, I'm interested in that. I'm like, wow, I gave you my business card, and you even give me a call today. <laughs> okay, I just thought of somebody else. Okay, people. All right. So anyway, thanks for joining Street Meet, the point listening audience, and I hope to have your support. We, we do accept donations, crowdfunding support, and your participation. Everyone is valuable in your participation to help yourself. Family, community, local, state, region, federal, and global community relies on the many people that contribute to it being an effective structure. <laughs> Thanks again. Good night. Saw you, Brias. Please visit www.streetmeet.biz. I like what I said. www. It's just like I say rat riff. I know it. Rat riff. <laughs> anyway, rat riff. I mean rat riff. Rat riff. <laughs> I was like, yeah, who is that? Them, 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 and rough, rough. That's what it sounds like, right, Liz? <laughs> anyway, www.streetmeet.biz and our cadet partner, www.meetup.com, backstreetmeet. TTYL, people, Mayana.